Into the Void was this uh, music festival organized by Ahmedabad based company called Drone Entertainment and it was first of its kind because it was happening in white desert run of kutch and that had all independent bands live bands and no electronic music or EDM or anything of that sort the entire vibe that was there it was uh, one of the most beautiful places that we have traveled to and uh, apart from the vibe the the kind of music that was left at that place and the resonance that was there it's still there I and mean, there were bands like thermal and the water uh, mother jane that we all have sort of looked up to so the second day i think was the best lineup out of all the three days and that that was the most power packed lineup and we saw scrat scrat was amazing they just set the stage on fire it was a very fierce set performed by scrat the from the moment they came to the time they exited the stage that thing was there and mother jane made everybody nostalgic with those old songs that we have all grown up listening to and obviously uh, Tamil and the Quarter the band that we all were waiting for i saw them for the first time i'm a huge fan of that band and that was some next level international level thing and we witnessed that band and i still get goosebumps when i talk about it and i was 6 years old when Tamil and the Quarter started daira got to share stage with such bands and that's one thing that we'll always remember for the rest of our lives so i think that was there the showmanship was there everybody was really excited they were all looking forward to it so the experience was amazing the way they everybody performed and we had karan chitra deshmukh featuring alongside us he's a damn good percussion player so that added a lot of uh, magical layers भोसड़ी के सीना पीती हूँ तुम मेरे पैसों पे चल रहे तुम साले मेरे पैसों पे चल रहे मेरे पैसों अभी एड़ा बनती है ना उड़ा डालेगा अब उनका कोई भाई नहीं lot of aspects in in terms of the kind of artists that performed with us the kind of production that was there it was one of the biggest gigs but uh, i would still rate our diy album launch gig as one of the biggest gigs that we have done there is there is no particular event that can change everything uh, like overnight but i think the i we will achieve a what to the to have the ball rolling in in our own way i think the band needs to be heard more and more and that has always been our uh, intention to get i have been trying to get more and more gigs in different cities and we try to have our album reached out to as an as more and more audience as possible as an as many audiences as possible <laughs> together for till the time we are alive